The 360 is a foundational movement in mace training and a powerful practice in developing grip strength, core stability, shoulder health and overall upper body strength. In this video we'll break down some key components and principles that we can put into practice to help you master this movement. Begin with the mace in a vertical centre position with your hands stacked and in front of your navel. This is your starting point and finish point for every rep. Because the 360 generates centripetal force, choking up on the handle and shortening the lever will make things easier for you while lengthening the lever will increase the challenge. There are two movements I like my students to practice before we get into the 360. The first one is a metronome. The side to side tilting of the mace while maintaining a central position with your hands helps to develop grip strength and positional awareness. The second exercise is called the pendulum. We begin with the mace in a vertical position with our hands stacked behind our head. Keeping our hands centered, we begin to swing the mace from side to side, gradually increasing the range until we meet the float point which happens at about eye level. We are now ready to hit the 360. Begin by tilting the mace to the side before pushing up and hiding your hands behind your head as you pendulum the mace behind you. Hit that float point and then pull the mace back down to the start position with your hands in front of your navel. That float point is key because if you try to pull down in front of you before the mace has finished its pendulum, you'll end up being in a wrestling match with the mace, which we don't want. Over time you will develop an awareness of when tension needs to be applied and when it needs to be released. It's a balancing act. Too much tension will cause you to kill the flow, while not enough tension when you need it and you could lose control. When practicing the 360, imagine that you are in a narrow corridor with a low ceiling. This will stop you swinging wildly and help you maintain control of the mace. Mastering this skill will take time, but I hope this helps.